Hi, welcome to Wise Guys. Polynomial long division mixed with two different letters. When a polynomial with two different letters, for example, x and y, and how to do this kind of question. Here is the example. 8y cubed plus x cubed plus 12y squared x plus 6y times x squared. This divided by 2y plus x. Mixed with two letters, x and y. Same thing, we still need to follow. First step, check. Follow the descending order or ascending order, but you need uh, for both of them. This is a follow ascending, this follow ascending. This follow descending, this follow descending. Now, this one 2y plus x divided by is y at the first, x at the second. We don't need to change too many. So we keep 2y plus x, which is y at the first, x at the second. So this is the 8y cubed, which is a high exponent. And after y squared, now you have x cubed. And think about it. This is the y squared, or after y cubed, this is the x cubed. But there is y squared y. So you can see, you look at the y cubed. After y cubed, suppose y squared. Then y exponent, and this is the y is descending from 3 to 1. And x, at this term, there are no x, means x is 0 exponent. Then go to 1 exponent, 2 exponent, then 3 exponent. That's why in this situation, we need to move x cubed to the last. So move this one to there. So this situation we can write into 8y cubed and after cube is squared plus 12y squared x plus 6y x squared and plus x cubed. Then divide by 2y plus x. In this situation, you can see first is y. y is follow descending cube square 1, and the y is 0 exponent. And the x is ascending from 0 exponent to 1 exponent, 2 exponent, 3 exponent. Now, this is OK. This is the right order. Now, still doing the same way, two terms two terms. So 2 multiply which number? You got 8. You first figure out the number, right? So 2 multiply 4 is 8. Then we need y cubed. This is y. So we need to multiply y squared. So 2y multiply 4y squared, you got 8y cubed. See? Exactly the same. And then you no choice, you just follow x times 4y squared, you call 4 as positive 4y squared x, and then subtract. And then also change the subtraction to add its opposite. So now we have 12 minus 4, you call 8y squared x. Carry down next next term is plus six y x squared, and same thing matching eight, which is two multiplied four is positive plus four, and this is y this is y squared multiplied y, and two y multiplied four y is eight y squared, but they have x. That's why you have another x here. So that means four y x. Multiply 2y, you call it 8y square x, which make exactly the same. Then the second term is 4yx multiply x, which is plus 
4y x squared, right? Because x times x and x squared, and subtract. Change subtraction to add its opposite. Now we have 6 minus 4 equal 2. Y x squared. And carry down the next term, which is plus x cubed. Same thing, this is 2, this is 2, that's a plus, plus 1, right? 1, we don't need to write the 1. But we just write the y, here is the y. We have x squared, there are no x squared, that's why this is the x squared. So which is 2y multiplied by x squared is 2y x squared. Same coefficient, same letters, same y, same x squared. The next is x times x squared is x cubed. In this situation, Subtract or equals zero, a divisible. So the answer equals 4y squared plus 4yx plus x squared. This is the answer. Thank you. This is presented by Weisskan.